Hi everyone, it's me Katrina from Katrina's Crochet World. Today we're going to learn the rope stitch. So with this pattern, you got to do a multiple of chain 3, plus 2, and plus 1. I have done my chain here. So to start off, we're going to do one double crochet in the fourth chain. 1, 2, 3, 4. Chain one and one double in the next. Skip one, one double crochet in the next two stitches. Sorry, you got a chain one and then double crochet. Skip one one double crochet chain one one double crochet skip one chain one double crochet chain one one double crochet skip one one double crochet into the next And just continue this till we get to the end. It's a very uh, beginner friendly. It's all done in double crochets, very simple. Sorry if you guys heard that dog. Neighbors are always got their dog outside barking. So I had to close my window. It's beautiful out today. All right, so we're almost at the end here. And when we get there, we got one left and we're going to do a double crochet. That's what it looks like. So at the end, we're going to chain three and turn our work. So in between these crochets, so we're gonna skip these two and right here, we're going to do one double crochet chain one, one double crochet. Then in the next, skip those two. One double, chain one, one double. And into the next one double chain one one double it's always in the chain one space where you go to do your one double crochet chain one one double to crochet chain one So you skip these two into the next, insert your hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, chain one, and in that same space you're going to do another double crochet, insert your hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, 
pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. I do have to say though with this yarn it does kind of twist about. It is very nice yarn though. Okay, so we're going to skip the next two chains. In that chain one space we're going to yarn over, insert our hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. Chain one, double crochet. We'll just continue this till we get to the end. And you can make this cowl as long as you want if you want it double wrapped around your neck or if you want it just once. That is totally up to you. So I am at the end here to do in my last double crochet, chain one double crochet. So in this chain space here, at the top, we're going to do one double crochet. Chain three. And turn our work. So we're going to skip that stitch. And right in between these two stitches here, we're going to do double crochet. Insert your hook. Pull up a loop. Yarn over. Pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. Chain one. Yarn over your hook. Insert your hook. Pull up a loop. Yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. Skip this stitch. Right in between those two. Yarn over and do a double crochet. Chain one and one double crochet. Pretty simple pattern. You just do one double crochet, chain one, one double crochet. So you skip the chain one and you go into here. That's where you work. I, I'd call it the V. There's a, it's like a V. Insert your hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, Yarn over, pull through two, chain one. And at the end, when you always get to the end, you always chain three. So I'm at my last end here to do my two double crochet or one double crochet, chain one, one double crochet. Look at that color that's coming in. Looks so beautiful. Very pretty spring colors. Okay, so in that turn and chain of three, you're going to count up from the bottom one, two, three. And in the third stitch, or you can just from the top, insert your hook, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. Chain three. And turn your work. Again, you skip this. In this spot here, you're going to do two double crochet, chain one, two double crochet. And it's just a repeat all the way across. So I will continue doing this and I will work this up and I will let you know what to do next. All right, everybody, I am back. So I have reached the end here. And we are going to fold this up. Just have a decent length here. And then we're going to give it a cut.
I'm just going to pull this through just to kind of give it a little knot. Alrighty. And grab one of the darn new. And then we're going to sew this up. You don't have to sew it up. You can uh, slip stitch or single crochet around this to attach it together. Uh oh. I really, really love this yarn. It is so pretty. It is soft. All right. So, and look at the look at the colors. Isn't that pretty? All right. So we're gonna start in the corner, right up in here. Probably made it too long, but that's okay. It's always good to have extra, extra yarn or thread, whatever you're using. And we're just going to go all the way across, go into every single stitch. You go into the top stitches all the way across. So you just continue this till you reach the end. So I'm going to continue to do this. And then when I reach the end, I will show you what to do next. Alrighty, so I am coming to my end here. Let's finish this up. What I like to do on my ends is to weave them in. So I will go on the other side and just weave them in. It's just extra to hold them so you know it's secured. And just kind of give it a little pull and cut that off. I'm going to weave this in as well so it's not sticking out. Cut 
that off. And then what you're going to do is flip that inside out. And there is your wonderful cowl. And this is a shorter one. It's not as, as long. So that is done in the rope stitch. I hope you all really enjoyed this. And if you would like, please hit that uh, thumbs up, subscribe, bu subscribe button, and hit that bell so you can get notifications when I post my videos and my lives. Um, in my page there, in my about page, I do have a my Facebook account, if you guys would like to join that, I do have merch in Teespring that you guys can purchase. There's all different types of patterns, um, things you can buy. I also as well have a PayPal account if you'd like to donate to my PayPal account to help my uh, channel out as well. All donations will be going towards my uh, channel for new lighting, um, cameras, mics, whatever need be. Um, I also have my email in my about page. If you guys want to give me an email, I do sell all of my stuff. I do have prices. I've had quite a few people on YouTube as well that have purchased my stuff. Um, so yes, I hope you guys enjoy this pattern. It is the rope. I hope you all have a great day. Take care, be safe, and happy crocheting. Bye-bye.